what's up guys it's your girl l just living welcome back to my channel <laughs> if you're new here go ahead and like subscribe and turn on notifications if you're into fun family and catching flights baby we're about adventure and today we are actually leaving the city so we're headed to the mountains and the area in particular that we're checking out today is hatta hatta mountains now a little tip a little secret a little some little knowledge this part of dubai was actually gifted to them um from the sheikh of oman yes the sheikh of oman gifted this part of dubai to the sheikh of dubai all right let's go Okay, so we are staying at a lodge on a cliff. So we can't just walk up there with all of our luggage, y'all. That's too hard. So they have these little go-karts, these little carts to take us to our lodge. But of course, the views on the way up, I was just loving it. I'm such a nature girl. I really am. Look at little Bay. Just bouncing along, just bouncing along. <laughs> but yeah, so they give us these carts to take us to the lodges. And when you see the lodges, they're quite unique. So I was looking for a unique experience, and it looks like I found one. it's your girl l just living welcome back to my channel <laughs> okay so today we are in hatta it's about an hour and a half drive outside of dubai like four far out away from the city away from it all and so it's the beginning of our spring break yes and so we're gonna have a little fun out here in hatta now it's located like i said in the desert further away from everything else, very near to Oman. Oman is literally like five kilometers away from where we're located right now. We could probably walk to the next country at this point. The drive in here was absolutely beautiful. Just the scenic, the scenes, the mountains. I just love the mountain views and I can't wait to hike the mountain here tomorrow. But yeah, so now we're about to go see what we can get into. Um, here's a quick little room tour.
we're gonna go see what activities they have to offer. As you can see, the views here are amazing. I can't wait to see the sunrise and the sunset. I think we'll get the sunset on this side, which is awesome, perfect. Um, so we'll check that out later, but let's go get into some things, shall we? can't see cute but I can't see okay we're about to go throw well, hold up we're about, we're about to go um we call it bow and arrow arrowing archery that's what it is who's gonna win you know who I'm kind of competitive always me the winner no you're not always the winner and you owe me from that um the no, last, the last time the last time I totally the last beat time you. you lost no the comments they said I won so we're <laughs> hello uh, yeah. where's archery oh it's right here yeah all right let's get to shooting some arrows okay so we're getting into archery and the trainer of course had well the coach had to show me how to use the bone arrow because it's not as easy as it looks on tv guys um i eventually get this one struggle a little bit but i got it check it out you need to pull pull stronger yeah yeah, that was very good. Two, three, strike. Now, some way, somehow, Bay is a natural at this type of stuff. Archery and even the axes that you'll see in just a moment. Ugh, I think it's just because he's a man, his physical build and all that kind of stuff, you know. But it's okay. Practice makes perfect. I'm going to come back and I'm going to get him. But he totally, totally hit it on the first try. Like, what the H? I bet you can't do it again. Cheer Papa on. Go, Papa, go, go, go. 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 <laughs> All right, it's time to throw some axes. Throw an axe or two or three. Throw some more. Just in case you haven't noticed, I struggle a lot of it. I was about to say a little bit, a lot with this particular <laughs> technique. But once they show me the overhead, oh, it was on and popping. All right. So let's check out that.
nice one amazing good job nice one amazing good job okay bay did good or whatever <laughs> Well, he did great. Okay, fine. But we have worked up an appetite, so we're going to check out the food that they have on site before heading back to our lodge. It's a sandwich sandwich shop. Yeah. Little, huh? So now we are headed back to our lodge on a hill so that we can wait for our food shall and enjoy these views. <laughs> well, someone did not want to eat on the balcony. I'm not pointing any camera lenses or anything. <laughs> it's beautiful out there though. But okay, I'm gonna show you go. guys. Oh, we gonna go? Okay, I'm gonna show y'all what we eat. I got this. Hey, dynamite today. shrimp. Got my salad. What else you got over here? Oh, he done tore into that garlic bread. Dynamite chicken. Let me see your salad. I mean your um, pasta. Mmm. And it's so good, y'all. From a Adrena Italian restaurant. It's good too. And we got some mojitos. Virgin, of course. <laughs> Virgin mojito. I said about a little shot, a little something, something to put in my mojito. I wasn't thinking. Next time. Go ahead, going over there. Shooting at you. Move your hand, let me see. Buka. Boo. Buka. What you doing over there? <laughs> Alright. Alright guys. So I am tired. He's cutting the likes and stuff off already. But I'm um, about to prepare for bed and get ready for tomorrow because tomorrow we go hiking. Ready, Z? Hiking with a baby. Uh, oh, did I tell you to subscribe? Yeah, go subscribe because we're on the road to 5K. We're trying to get to 5K. Me. You, five, K, go, like, subscribe, share, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend, comment in, something in the comment below. What y'all think about the archery though? Y'all, it was a lot harder than I expected it to be. I really did not think that shooting a bow and arrow was gonna be that tough. Now I see why it's such a, a skill when I'm watching like the Hunger Games and when I'm watching um, Green Arrow. I'm like, it ain't nothing but an arrow. It's more than that. Ooh, it was so hard. But it wasn't as hard as the knives, throwing the axe, I mean. <sighs> Who would have thought? There's a skill to a technique to throwing an axe. It's a real technique when you gotta release. Now it is. Who would have thought? Gotta just get in and just <laughs> No, you can't do that. You have to actually have a skill to throw an axe. But I was good with that over the head though. It was the one this one right here the one hand I struggled with that but the over the head both like, ah, 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 ah. yeah I had that one down pat <laughs> they have a whole lot of stuff to do here they have the zip lining they have the um, tree rope stuff they got the water slides not ain't getting no water though. they got all the water activities and stuff like that they have kayaking they have parasailing they have just a whole bunch of stuff to do but I'm uh, we're about to call it a night because we've got to pick a day ahead of us in the morning because we're going hiking, like I said. And I don't know if we're going to make it with a baby. All right, y'all. As always, it's your girl, L Just Living. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment down below. Until next time, love you, bunches.